Today I've got a Dell Inspiron 1501. This is a client system that crashed. It's either a bad hard drive or corrupt operating system. It just won't boot. So step one is to retrieve all the data off this hard drive and make a good backup of that. And I'll be using a USB to SATA and IDE adapter to get that done. On the back of the system, uh, bottom side of the system, we've got the hard drive right here. I'm just gonna pull two screws. One, two. These are very easy to work on. Hard drive just slides right out. This is a SATA hard drive. See your data connector, power connector. There's a lot of different USB um, to SATA adapters out on the market. This is an inexpensive one, it works well. It's by Kingwin. Been decent, no problems with it. I'll show you the parts. What you'll find in one of these USB to SATA adapter kits, typically, depends on the manufacturer, but you'll have your AC adapter with an IDE power connector, a USB connector of some sort, either micro or mini USB. Your adapter for SATA, IDE, and laptop IDE. Um, IDE to SATA power adapter, and SATA plug. Also included, which I've already got plugged in, is the uh, connector for your AC adapter. So it's pretty simple, just plug that in. Now in the case of a SATA drive, we connect IDE adapter to the, or IDE, the IDE power to the SATA adapter. Do it the right way though. Your SATA plug goes here. This particular one has a little clip on it. Plugs in just like this. Here it snap in. These have an L shape. The SATA connectors, you'll see them. There's a key on one side. Plugs in straight, and your disc will spin up. That's really all there is to it. My USB connector goes in the other end here. And then you plug that into whichever machine you want to extract your data to. This is a ProStar M55G that I've had sitting around for a while. Real basic machine, works pretty good, happy with it. Plug that one in. We've got a little Hitachi USB drive, and we're just gonna transfer the data from the other hard drive. We are ready to go. Copy and paste it. That's it. That's all there is to it. Thanks a lot. Bye.